OBT, one of the oldest hand-woven carpet companies in the world, and the largest in India, with headquarters in the northern town of Mirzapur. Mirzapur is situated on the banks of the sacred river Ganges, between the two holy cities of Allahabad and Varanasi, in a region I like to think of as the heart of India. And in 40 years of working as a journalist in this country, I've come to have a special affection for the carpet industry, and Mirzapur is traditionally regarded as its capital. Carpets are works of art. Weaving them is one of the ancient crafts for which India is so rightly famous. And carpet manufacturing puts money where it's most needed, into the villages of India. It was in the 16th century when the Mughals ruled India that artisans from Central Asia travelled down the Grand Trunk Road and brought carpet weaving to Mirzapur. Today, those weavers' traditional craft is preserved by OBT. Three Englishmen founded OBT in 1920, bringing together weavers under the banner of a modern company able to provide a global market for their skills. OBT is, in its essence, a creative enterprise. Customers come to us to get color and texture into their homes. But it also reflects a heritage. The process of weaving a carpet is a way of life, and we are committed to protecting that way of life. The looms weaving OBT carpets are spread over an area of 100,000 square kilometers. They enable some 20,000 artisans to earn a living in their own villages. OBT artisans often combine farming with carpet weaving. 75-year-old Sonai is a weaver and a farmer in Fodipur village. His son Hira and his grandson Mohinda are following in his footprints. They are master craftsmen too. All weavers are registered and meticulous records are kept to ensure they comply with the social responsibility OBT demands and that their carpets are completed on schedule. Can you bring Hera up onto the screen? Here. Father's name, year of birth, and his address. We have a dedicated uh, department, a team of officers for social accountability checks. They would go to the looms over and above what uh, production inspectors are doing. And they would be checking basically on social compliance issues. Pradeep Singh is one of OBT's 75 staff employed on inspecting the looms. He inspects the looms in his area every 15 days. There are surprise checks from head office too. OBT's system for preventing child labor has been acclaimed by the International Labor Organization and other world bodies. Carpet weaving hasn't changed for centuries. There can be as many as 425 knots in each square inch of a carpet. And the quality of carpets depends on the number of the knot. Every weaver ties between six to 9,000 knots per day. Five weavers would take as long as one and a half years to complete a carpet like this. 
In designing, tradition has changed. Formerly, each design of a carpet was painted by hand. Now, designs are painted on computers. The design is the map a weaver works from. Each square represents one knot. Armed with the latest technology, OBT artists now produce 6,000 designs and color combinations every year. This gives the customers greater freedom of choice. Earlier, the buyer used to give us ju just the designs, and we used to copy that only. Now they send us a mood board, and for the color story, they send like this is a green color story they are going to run. Out of this, we can uh, develop different uh, designs, and we show them 20, 30 options to the buyer, and they can select out of this. So you get this flexibility basically because of these computers. That's what's changed it all. So definitely the software has helped us a lot to improve upon our quality of the work and the time we take. In carpet we have some repeat motifs. So it has a very quick option in Texel through which the motifs can be repeated very easily. Then if we want to change colors, just a single click can change the color of the designs. So OBT uses the latest computer technology to design carpets which customers ask for, but also to develop its own unique line in carpets. The color is crucially important in a carpet. OBT has more than 2,000 different shades of wool in its color bank. Great care is taken to see that the colors chosen match the designs exactly. All OBT wool is of the highest quality. The company is the world's first Woolmark licensee for handmade carpets and brand partner for Wolves of New Zealand. Every delivery of wool, yarn, chemicals and other raw materials is tested in OBT's state-of-the-art laboratory to ensure the quality is up to the high standard demanded by OBT. OBT's dye house is one of the largest in the carpet industry. Twenty thousand kilograms of wool can be coloured in its vast vats every day. Experiments are conducted to try and expand even further the range of colors OBT can offer its customers. All the dye is eco-friendly. These mounds of rice husk form the bulk of the fuel used to generate steam for the dye house. It's also considered eco-friendly, unlike coal or oil. The carbon dioxide produced when rice husk is burnt is utilized by plants. OBT has also chosen to produce gas from rice husk to generate electricity, even though it's a far more complicated process than the normal method used in India, running diesel or petrol generators, which are not eco-friendly. OBT is very conscious of the fact that this factory could cause a great deal of pollution. So I'm standing here on an effluent treatment plant which makes sure that all the water which is used in the process of dyeing the wool is purified. The purified water irrigates the fields around the factory.
OBT also manufactures hand-tufted carpets. They're woven by a handheld tufting gun, which attaches tufts of wool to a cotton canvas backing. Hand-tufted carpets come in designs as varied as hand-knotted ones. And some are woven with different kinds of wool, which give them unusual textures and appearances. OBT is the largest manufacturer of hand-tufted carpets, and what is distinctive is the professionalism of my colleagues in OBT. This ensures that the supply chain of our hand-tufted carpets is resilient, so we can absorb changes in terms of colors, patterns, and sizes effectively. Also, hand-tufted carpets are made in fewer number of days, so when there is a large amount of product to manufacture, our processes allow that we can make those products effectively without defect. And this, I think, is a form of uniqueness in our tufted collection. After they've been woven, OBT carpets are singed on the back. Then they're soaked. This may look like a very rough and ready process, but it's highly skillful. Washing can make or mar a carpet. OBT factory, where the final processes of manufacturing a carpet take place. Clippers remove the excess pile. The patterns are clearly defined, a particularly skillful job which can easily wreck a carpet. Utmost attention is given to getting the tiniest detail right. We are a capitalist, and we have a responsibility, and a big responsibility, to make sure that we are creative in the designing and the coloring of our products so that they don't become part of a commodity, special each in their own way, and therefore we have a market and a strong market, and that is what um, is the strength of OBT, and that strength is totally and absolutely dependent upon the people who work in the company, of which I am one. Finally, the last inspection, when the carpets are checked to see the highest quality has been maintained at every stage of production. OBT inspectors have a motto, if in doubt, reject. It's not surprising that OBT has received international awards for excellence in design and in 2008 was given an award by the President of India. This is a varied selection of the carpets which have passed the final test. Their colors and patterns show that OBT is a leader in fashion and design.
This work of art, made from top quality wool, with nearly 10 million knots, has taken six weavers a year and a half to produce. It's the end product of all the creativity, all the skill, and all the hard work that goes into an OBT carpet. Being hand knotted, it'll last for a lifetime or more. Then there are the tufted carpets, for those who might want to change their floor covering from time to time. There are OBT carpets to suit all tastes and all budgets. I treasure the two OBT carpets that have adorned my home for many years now. Eventually the carpets are packed and dispatched to five different continents. There are OBT showrooms in New York, Atlanta, Zurich and Delhi. So, OBT continues to provide Indian weavers with a highly sophisticated infrastructure and a global market for their centuries-old skills. <laughs> 